Welcome in this new video tutorial from uh, Realflow and uh, Krakatoa. I am uh, Matteo Migliorini and I am a CG artist and now we can uh, show you how uh, we can uh, use uh, Hybrido and uh, extract the, the particle for Krakatoa. In the first time we can see here the little uh, simulation and I used uh, for used hybrido for use uh, more uh, details. Uh, maybe you can up the resolution. In this case, it's very low resolution, but you can use more resolution for create uh, a good uh, good effect. And uh, another aspect very important when you export from export central in uh, the grids domain and or uh, or grids emitters, you can check. Uh, the the grid domain particle and you can check the particle Krakatoa and you can choose uh, more value for example position velocity texture or vertices or e in ed for of the particle when you setting this you can uh, create the simulation and when uh, finish inside uh, of the um, the folder of a particle you can find more particle with dot prt its uh, extension this is the extension for krakatoa and when you open uh, 3dx max for uh, you can uh, load this particle for load this particle in the first time you can choose uh, the the render setting so I renderer krakatoa okay and you can apply your particle in uh, Krakatoa but uh, very important is customize the unit setup the system unit setup is meters because uh, real flow it's uh, working with meters every 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 uh, squ square it's uh, it's uh, one meters of the grid it's one meter so, so it's very important use the same unit setup for example one meters for now and I use generic in this case is then for uh, uh, display it's uh, it's okay okay now I go to Krakatoa Krakatoa appear uh, T loader and create the loader and choose my folder with um, the grid fluid and I can up okay now I don't see nothing but uh, one moment I choose the same scale of animation okay if you scroll you can see now I have the the little square with uh, the counts for a particle uh, I disabled the, the grid but uh, you can see it's not have the same duration of axis so you can uh, use the, um, the rotate and the snap angle for rotate correct your sequence and now you can see I have uh, for example the big dimension of uh, your icons it's not very uh, important to have the the icon for uh, this uh, this case so you can go in uh, modifier from uh, modifier you can go in the first time you can re off render the percentual for render you can up 1000 so you can see all uh, of your particle in viewport and another it's a display icon you can uncheck display icon because it's not important to see the icon of your loader so you can see now I have the same animation in the same particle and now we can render this particle for render this particle is very important to create uh, the light when you create the light uh, uh, you can see the particle if you don't create light uh, you can see the particle for create light you can go on uh, your GUI of uh, Krakatoa and choose uh, from a schematic view in schematic view you can see all your part or node is composite in uh, Krakatoa elements and uh, 
here you have the warning the warning because you don't have the light so you can go in this node this node is this node the short for light you have you don't have the light you can cre create light with the simple uh, cl click uh, or uh, press the right button for mouse and create the full spot light or you can uh, also create your light from uh, uh, the create panel light standard light omni for example or uh, maybe you can create the sky light or target spots you, you can create what uh, do you want from uh, for lights it's not very important for now uh, for example if you have the the light in your chain you can also from a schematic view choose sk sky for example in this case the light or uh, create the spotlight it's, uh, now you can see it's okay so you can have uh, create the light when create the light the light is very high for example here you can uh, go in the front view and uh, take and break down again more okay I can delete for example the, the skylight come back in prospective and I can put the camera with Ctrl C from viewport for create the camera from viewport now you can see here I have okay it's uh, okay the spotlight in my machine it's all it's okay and now I can render if when uh, I render for now in this case okay I see my particle from uh, from the viewport also you can uh, for example in this case it's very nice uh, or I can create sky light also for give another aspect of my also spotlight is plus and I render again so you can choose um, to change the lock of the your uh, your particle for example give a more color and you can also change the density also I can use the light pass for example for create particular case can use the force ad adaptive for example you, you don't need to to setting this value or you can put more okay for, for example maybe in this case it's uh, very nice use the force emitter for create the next effect so when you render in another moment for example from the start moment AB6 you find uh, the nice effect and also you can apply for example the motion blur to four pass forever the particle effect or maybe two it's okay